Hello and welcome to Sullivan's Farm again and what I'm going to be doing today is just measuring grass. I have started doing it I suppose really when the, the pressure comes on in the spring and in the autumn when grass can, can get a little bit tight now that we've gone up in stock numbers. Uh, so I started measuring grass uh, probably two years ago now and, and really kind of started doing it properly this year. Uh, I don't live and die by the, the famous wedge or anything like that but I do find it a very useful tool so um, I'm just going to show you how, how I do it. Let's go for a look then. So what you can see there is the roll of masking tape uh, to give you some sense of, of how much grass we're, we're looking at here in this particular paddock and that's the masking tape I use to stick the selfie stick onto the shovel uh, for all these kind of action shots as I showed you in a previous video but anyway I try to get down low then and um, just kind of grab a fist of grass like that and say look at it's about like a fistful to me is about 500 kgs of dry matter per hectare uh, that's the was the, the unit of measure let's call it that so do that in a few places and um yeah i'm, I'm going, to, going to say it's coming up there fistful the height of my fist is about 500 um in this particular patch so what i do is repeat that in a few different places in the paddock and um take a rough estimate from there so fistful is 500 two fistfuls is a thousand as we might see in the next paddock so we're in the next paddock now as you can see the grass is a bit stronger here there's the masking tape again uh something of a reference point so put the fist in here grab it there fist on top it's over it a little bit not a huge amount i would be calling that maybe a thousand eleven hundred of uh, a cover in this field and um, yeah, that's that's pretty much the only way I, or that's as accurate as I do it. Come on, so so. Hard enough to see from here but after doing a few paddocks then you you kind of train the eye in and you you eyeball it as as they say mind the flies it is nice and warm still i suppose the flies are still around but it's it's probably hard to see it there now on camera but i'd be looking at that now and without getting in there on my hands and knees and grabbing a couple of fistfuls of it in a few different places i'd be saying there's probably about 1300 on that and and that's the number then i'd be i'd be putting into pasture base as well so. Anyway, that's how I measure grass. Um, nothing fancy. There's there's lots of other, well, several other techniques you could use. There's the special tools you can use. There's a sword stick. I've I've used that before. Another simple uh, idea to, to give you a sense of it. But the one fist equals five hundred, and two fists equals a thousand, is is generally enough for me. Uh, I turn around then, put the numbers into the pasture base app from Chagask. Uh, it's, it's it's a very simple app to use. Put in all your the names of all your paddocks and then how much acres or how many hectares are in each and that gives you a summary then at the end when all the figures are in to tell you generally how much grass you have and the growth rates in the different fields since you you last did it so i i do it on a weekly basis as i said in the um, the shoulders of the year in spring when I'm, I'm trying to get the cattle out and in autumn when when grass is starting to get scarce and you're wondering how soon you need to have the the shed ready um before they need to go into it and they run out of grass pasture base i find very simple there's there's lots of bells and whistles which i don't use but the basic stuff is is very good for me and um i'd heartily recommend it nobody's asked me to say that uh i'd say that gladly um i might have other issues with chagask advisory and chagask research and, and and all those other bits and pieces but um pasture base is is a tool i would recommend to to anybody um so that's it the mind the shovel i was doing a different job with that so just a quick video to, to talk about measuring grass and and how useful it can be if you have any comments or any questions or i've, I've left out huge gaps and uh, none of it makes sense um let me know in the the comments section below um but yeah that's that's pretty much it thank you very much again and um we'll talk soon good luck